We're here at last for the Leadership for Life, which was set up by the late Michael Brown. Uh, he would have loved to have been here to see the work that we're doing here and, and the difference that his program is really making to the people around these, these countries that we visit. He would be very proud of the work that we're doing. And Datacom is a IT services organisation. New Zealand owned and based, um, has 4,000 staff in New Zealand, Australia, the Philippines and Malaysia. They um, a real a keen, long running philosophy around sustainability and, and part of this program around MGSM and the program that we are on is um, helping um, organisations in a charitable way um, from a sustainability perspective. So we are here from a learning perspective, a team building perspective, but also uh, we are keen to try and make a, a long-lasting difference to the local community here. Do it right. That's all about actually doing it properly and watching this team every step along the way. Everybody has been very focused about what they're trying to do, to achieve. There's certainly the openness and honesty part um, where this environment is one where you know, there are no secrets. We, we wash in the middle of the village. I think it takes down a lot of barriers. Um, and, and makes makes us better people, I think. The living is, is tough. It's a culture shock. You know, um, you're just used to your own privacy, your own space. Uh, over here, everything is shared. Shared bathrooms, shared toilets. I mean, the toilets, you know, it's uh, it's just a flat basin. And um, you got to squat. And... I've realised that my squatting abilities have improved immensely over the last four days. Uh, I've got a, every day is a PB for me. Datacom's very focused on what we call collaborative diversity, which is about people coming together from all walks of life. One of the core values is um, and prove the promise. We are given a task each day. We try to complete certain things, certain parts of the bungalow, as you can see from behind. Having our own skill sets, for example, Gary was an electrician, you know, he used his, um, his previous skills and knowledge to, to add on value to the eco bungalow. When we first make brick, people not come to see our work so much. I mean the village around. But uh, when we start building the wall, and now it's more than 10 people come every day, they try to check it. They try, try, try. This is very strong. It's interesting. Now everyone has a bamboo house, and it's not last long. So they're looking for the wood. That's the next step. They're looking for the big tree and cut down and carry from very far away and collecting for five years, ten years to build the, 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 the wood house. From the wood house, next step is cement house. So this is the house they know. Bamboo, wood and cement. They don't know the earth house and now they saw it. I think this is an example for them and they will learn and since it depends on them they will choose to build or not. And from my perspective and I think probably most of the team's perspective is how Datacom can actually make a meaningful contribution to that in a, lo in a longer term sort of way. Um, I think personally think it's very worthwhile. Expect less from life and enjoy more of what is around you.